India has successfully tested a cutting-edge weapon for the first time. Using a high-powered laser weapon, a 30-kilowatt laser beam, using six 5-kilowatt beams, with a range of 4 kilometers, capable of neutralizing drones, UAVs, and static targets, developed by the Defense Research and Development Organization, along with some other government laboratories, academic institutions, and private industry, with a clear aim of disabling enemy drones, optics, and electronic systems. The MK-2A laser weapon tracked the drone, fired a laser beam, and effectively destroyed the target. This breakthrough marks a significant leap for India's armed forces, especially as drone warfare becomes a dominant force in modern conflicts like the war in Ukraine. With the demonstration of its defense capabilities, India has entered an elite club of nations, including US, Russia, China, UK, Germany and Israel, which have mastered this technology. Although only US, Russia and China have only used laser weapons against aerial threats. The successful trial of the Directed Energy Weapon, DIW, system, with a 30 kilowatt laser, was carried out at the National Open Air Range in Andhra Pradesh's Kurnool. The DIW can engage targets at the speed of light. This development comes amid the security threat posed by the proliferation of unmanned aerial systems, UAS, and the emergence of drone swarms. This also marks an important milestone in developing next-generation hypersonic missiles that can travel at speeds five times the speed of sound. Yeah, that is the future which we are working on. It will take some more time. We have to work on a few more technologies. One is scaling the power. One is the beam combination to achieve higher efficiency of their combination. But we are sure that in in the next few years, we will have this capability. We are also, as DGECS mentioned, looking at how we can miniaturize it to put it on airborne platforms, how to put it on ships. So this is a journey which has started today, which is a demonstration what we gave you today. It's just the start of the journey. And with the synergy that this lab has achieved with other DRDO laboratories, industry and academia, I'm sure we'll reach our destination soon. One of the biggest dangers to our country are negative influencers, dirty influencers. These are people who are there on digital mediums only to get numbers. And what they do has had a very negative effect on our society. We all know about it. But together, you and I can change that. Republic is starting an influencer incubator program where you can be part of creating some world-class content that is nation first, that helps our country, that creates awareness. And you can work with me here on this campus as part of the first phase of the Republic Influencer Incubator program, which is the Positive Influencers program. The Positive Influencers program, which is going to be run from the Republic Media Campus, which is the largest newsroom in Asia, aims to bring together a diverse set of people from across the country. You can work from where you are, you can work with me here on this campus to create content on anything which you feel, if it proliferates, if it spreads, will have a positive impact on our people. It could be in the area of health, technology, defense, awareness, current affairs, politics, or even history, science and technology. I know there are a lot of you out there who have the talent and all that you want is the reach. And Republic is doing this to give your content the reach. Together, all of us can come together and create a content revolution in our country. The digital medium, the growth of digital in our country is one of the most fascinating things, but you can use it in a positive way for the country or you can use it in a negative way for our country. There are too many people who are using the digital medium to make a quick buck. But together, all of us, if we become one unit that's working in national interest, that believes in nation first, then through the Positive Influencer Program, we can change the way the digital medium works in our country. So come, I welcome you to work with me here on the Republic campus 
as part of the Positive Influencer Program. Here on the Republic Media Campus, you will have access to great infrastructure, a warm and welcoming professional environment, and of course, the best production values. Now, if you have the content and you feel it needs the finish, it needs to be worked on, or that you would benefit from working in an environment where there are many other content creators like you, then you can be here. You can work with me here in the Republic Newsroom. You can work from home. You can make it 50-50. You can make it work the way you want. As long as you believe that the content you create and we believe that the content you create will make our nation number one, will be one solid contribution towards the Vixit Bharat, then you can be part of this wonderful program. The initiative I announced in the presence of the Prime Minister at the Republic Summit, which is the Republic Positive Influencer Program. So come, work with me, work with us. Let's make a difference for our country.